Any theater or any professor will tell you that it's a great accomplishment and fills you with pride to see your students graduate and also to see them succeed in their profession. And one would say even further when they are asked to come back as a distinguished alumnus. And this year that tradition continues with a class of 2010 graduate, Miss Cindy Winters. Uh, this year's recipient began her career, she would tell you, from her living room, singing for her family that would endlessly clap for her, which would only drive her to play more. Uh, at about seven, her mother suggested she grow up to be a pediatrician. She quotes, she doesn't think she could even spell that, so she don't think she could seriously consider it. Uh, Cindy ignored that advice and continued to do what she loved. Her father, who was a, ho whose hobby was a, as a concert photographer, exposed her to the world further where she met some of the biggest stars and after high school she started to work as a commercial dancer in Miami. Cindy took stock in her goals and decided New York was the place for her to be. When she came to New York, she enrolled in college. She also had the opportunity to perform at Madison Square Garden with the New York City dancers. Cindy began working professionally while enrolled as a theater student at Five Towns College. Cindy has been blessed with the opportunity of doing what she loves, performing in theatrical shows such as Pippin on Broadway, uh, Motown the musical on Broadway, and as the lioness Nala in Disney, Disney's theatrical phenomenon, The Lion King. She finds great joy and fulfillment in motiv motivating others with her passion for performing. And if all of her accomplishments aren't enough, Cindy still manages to find ways to make an impact. Currently, she is producing and starring in a one-woman event dedicated to legendary American icon, Lena Horne, which, we, which incidentally will be performed at Five Towns College Performing Arts Center in September. She's a proud Five Towns College alumnus who does her part in making an impact on the world. It's my great honor to present this year's Distinguished Alumnus Award to Cindy Winter. FFFTC 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 Five towns five towns Five towns five towns FFFTC 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 Five towns Five towns Five towns Five towns Class of 2015, what's up? I am so honored to be here. I have to be honest, I'm shocked. And I have made it back to FGC. So, class 2015, give yourselves a round of applause for being here. As we know, we all start off freshman year like, all right, my friends from high school are here, I'm starting new, everything's gonna be really awesome and great, I'm gonna see it to the end, and then half of us drop out, right? So I'm thankful and I'm, and I'm, I'm so proud of all of you who have made it here today. Yes, y'all should really turn up for that. Thank you. 
Distinguished Alumni Award. <laughs> Sounds pretty cool, huh? Now, when I first got to Five Towns in 2006, I, um, the school had a very um, new theater program, relatively new, and I was so excited to be a part of it. And in the hallway, in, in the front entrance in the uh, administration office, there was this area of the hallway called the Hall of Fame. I don't know if it's still there. But in the Hall of Fame, there were photographs, headshots, of all of the Five Town students who had attended, who had made it in the industry in some way. <clears throat> there was Adam Levine from Maroon 5. There was Wyclef Jean. There was Nina Sky. And there were a couple of other people. And I was kind of shocked that no, that, I mean, there wasn't really anybody represented from the theatrical department of the industry. So I was like, I'm out to change this. Right. So, I'm still amazed that I'm here. So anyway, to my speech. The recipient of such an award is one who demonstrates excellence and has achieved success in a highly competitive industry. Well, I can't say if I exemplify excellence or work harder than the next girl or guy, but I do know that I've always had something inside me that was always saying, do more, keep going. It could have been my father. Literally, he had me on a harness six o'clock in the morning on the track field, like, go! And I would be pulling him at 6 a.m., but that voice still stayed with me. When I first enrolled in Five Towns, I was going to college to satisfy my parents. How many of us actually do that? It's okay, you don't have to raise your hands. <laughs> Go to college, you'll have something to fall back on. So, I decided that I was going to study an insanely foolproof, useful, and totally secure profession, theater. My plan was to really fall back, so I just gotta keep going. I looked forward to learning and being a part of a new program at Five Towns College, and I wasn't sure if I was going to be able to balance a full-time, uh, be being a full-time student and working at Madison Square Garden as a Nick City dancer. This is all very new. And the greatest thing that I learned at Five Towns College is that they encourage you to hustle which is a really dope thing that not all colleges, you know, support. Now, I have this, well, it's honest that some of my teachers did not necessarily love my hustle technique. <laughs> Professor Kathy Curtis. Um, <laughs> but I learned a great deal from them, and I learned a lot in self-management, which when you leave here, and you leave the dorms, and you leave your parents' house, and you move out on your own and you get roommates, you have to be in charge of yourselves. It is nobody's fault for anything that you do in your life. Your successes are our successes. Your failures, well, they're your own. Now I lost my place. Oh, on school days I went to class, enjoying the intimacy of an environment where everybody knew your name, and I mean everybody knew your name. In that incubator, I began to play. James Beneducci always said, you guys have to play. And so, I did. Stalking the halls, shooting my friends with Nerf guns. I don't condone that, by the way. That was an old me. Um, and banging on the cafeteria tables, making up songs with friends. How many of you guys actually still do that? Yeah, thank you, thank you. Friends who I still stayed in contact with, I shot music videos with, I shot little pilots with, fun things that you have started here at Five Towns. Friends that I have shared a dressing room with on Broadway. It is so wonderful to me and to, to be an alumni of this school. <laughs> and us having that little secret as we see each other in the industry of that little school off the LIE. It kind of looked like a haunted middle school. <laughs> but I'm happy to know that FTC goes beyond your education here. It supports their alumni. 
as I began conceptualizing my one-woman show dedicated to American icon Lena Horne. It was my friends at Five Towns College and the administrators who leapt at the opportunity to debut my work here at Five Towns College Performing Arts Center in the fall 2015. A day I am sick over, yet I cannot wait for. So <laughs> being a student here was an experience of immeasurable weight. Thank you to the Board of Administrators of Five Towns College. It is truly an honor to receive this award today. And to the graduating class of 2015, congratulations. <laughs> On closing a chapter, after this day, always keep in mind that the hustle cannot and will not be taught. Thank you.